Here's the 0-2 to Pinales. This is grounded right side of the infield. Could be two, but one run will score. Hainline scoops to Russell for one that turned to first double play, but it's one nothing Bulldogs. Yeah, another ground ball. So nice, nice job of bouncing back from Spencer Jones after the mistake the the, the previous batter. Two two pitch, strike three, fastball over the plate, and we go to the third inning. One run scores. It's one nothing Gonzaga. The 3-1 is grounded right side. That is fair. Run scores as Calmer taps the bag, and it's all tied at one. So a good job by Matthews to chop this one down the first baseline and tie this game up at one. Pain line is deep in shallow right field from the second base spot. Here's the 3-2 to Apodaca. Check swing. Did he go around? Yes, he did. And the throw to first completes the K. So a big strikeout by Jones, strands a runner on third. We go to the fourth, all tied at one. Uh, pretty bunt right there, and uh, here comes some power with runners on second and third. Here's the pitch now to McGee. It is lifted into left center field as Apodaca is there to make the grab. Tagging from third, no throw on the relay, and it's 2-1 to one Cougs. Sam Brown gets home. You look at this offense, you look at this lineup and the one through nine, look at who your seven hole hitter is as a guy with eight home runs and uh, you, you have your offensive numbers are in the top four or five of uh, every category in the Pac-12. So uh, you're up there in the hit by pitch and on base percentage, you lead the league and you're third in doubles. 2-1 pitch is pulled down the left field line. That's a fair ball. Easily scoring is Kyle Russell. Hainline cruises in the second with another extra base hit in an RBI. It's 3-1 to one Cougs. Another pretty swing by Elijah Hainline, who may be uh, kind of locking in here and, and, and uh, heating up at, at the right time. So uh, another double here for the, the sophomore from Spokane with a lot of friends, a lot of family. Here's a 1-0 pitch to Stem. This is swung on, could be two. Grounded to Hainline, throws to second for one. Russell's throw to first in time, 4-6-3. There's a ground ball, and Duke Brotherton has seen two and two outs here in the bottom of the fourth. An 0-1 count here to the lefty Brown. Brown in his first at bat grounded out, but he singled and scored back in the fourth. Runner on thirds at Vincula. Pitches lifted into left center field deep enough for sure to score him. It's into the glove of the left fielder's stem, and at Vincula tags and scores to make it 4-1. The big industrial train going on in the background of the right field pitches. Strike three. Runner takes off for second. No throw. Ratfield watches that one go by. Now the runner on second now with one out in the fifth. Here's the 3-2 now to Eisenstadt. Runner takes off for second. Pitch is grounded up the middle into Russell's slide. Gets to his cleats. Throws to first. In time! Kyle Russell with a highlight 360 spin in shallow center to retire the side. We go to the back third of the ball game. Leather flashed by Russell here in Spokane. And a 4-1 to one Coug lead preserved. So two balls and two strikes here to the lefty Eisenstad. Cottrell really wants a strike out here. Get the first out of the inning. Either that or a ground ball, the 2-2. Breaking ball off the end of the bat. It's gloved by Cottrell, and he throws home for the force. What a play by Cottrell. It's snow cone on a high chopper to the mound, and he does well to transfer it and throw it home to get the force. One down, and it preserves a two-run lead. Wow, what a play from the senior left-hander. We talked about his work well, off-season program, kind of changing things around and, and, and working on some uh, his athleticism, and that was that was beautiful right there. That's a veteran move, ready to make a play, fielding position. So here's an 0-2 pitch to Ratfield. Bases loaded, two down. One run has scored the pitch. Swung on and missed strike three. Cottrell preserves the lead. One run scores. It was bases loaded, nobody out. Cottrell comes on and slams the door. We go to the ninth. It's 4-2 to two Cougs. 3-2 pitch coming here to Moranko. <coughs> Swing and a missed strike three. Fastball put by him. One down. And Cottrell's ready to deal. The 1-1. One, one. Swung on, popped up. That may do it. Matthews comes in shallow right field, lines it up, and makes the squeeze. 
and Washington State beats Gonzaga 4-2. to two. McCabe Cottrell comes on to seal the deal. And it's Jones, Brotherton, Farland, Wilford, Calber, and Cottrell that combine for the win. As the Cougars are 22-13 on the year and get a road win here in Spokane over the Bulldogs.